Happy New Year, everybody. I know it's February, but I thought I would go ahead and tell you that because it's been a while since we've started something new. We're going to start playing a little bit of Dinkum. I am your benevolent host, Stephen Thomas. Come along with the ride. This is like an Animal Crossing, Stardew Valley, Harvest Moon type game. And I figured we would mess around with it on and off and just see how it goes. It's still in early access, but I think it's got a lot of potential to it. And it's going to be a great time waster till the new uh, Harvest Moon game that they're creating. I think it's going to have a different series name, though, because a different company's making it. Uh, is developed and you all know that I'm a glutton for punishment when it comes to games like this that take forever I've actually never played Animal Crossing or anything of that nature and I hear this is kind of more toned toward that So this should be an exciting uh, experiment for me to mess around with I was gonna stream this but we've been having a lot of fun with Football Manager 2023 and I didn't want to derail that I've also got another game in the works that I'll probably start posting here uh, alongside of this one but if you're excited for this hit the like button let me know below what you're thinking if you want to be a patreon supporter or donate to the channel there are links all about but let's get right to it let's start a new game and let's enjoy some dinkum fun i guess it's supposed to be in the area that's kind of known as australia so we'll just have to see that is good god that is hideous is it like body type one body type two situations because these look terrible all right, we'll kind of get like, I don't want any comment from any of you all out there about that. Uh, it's going to be young me, so he'll have hair. He'll have lots of beautiful hair. Yeah, something like that. He needs to be very pale, though. Give him some blonde hair. Yeah, that that's more like me. There's not a lot of choices, but you know what? That's kind of okay. What do we got here? Oh, we could change his eyes. That's great. Why is his eyelashes just on the bottom? Don't don't you have eyelashes on top too? There we go. That's kind of all right. I do have super blue eyes. Um. Oh, these are noses. That's about right. Okay. Oh, we can't really change much. I do like the multicolored. We can't change the pants. All right. I guess this is what we're going with. Do I get the name him? What is your name? My name is Steven. Actually, we'll go by Steve. What is the island's name? Oh man, this is like the hardest part to decide right here. We've got like, we had Bourbon Island when we did our Tomodachi uh, series. I probably just said that wrong. Y'all are going to call me out on that, but that's okay. Um, so let's not do Bourbon Island. Let's, uh, I've changed my mind. We're just going to go ahead and call it Bourbon Island. Uh, do I need to put a uh, bourbon island or just bourbon? You know what? We'll just we'll see what they say. Maybe they just call it bourbon. A long time ago, everything went south. Ah, it's modern day America. This is nice. Almost everybody was forced to move to South City. The people of South City lived cold and miserable lives. You were born here. Look at they don't even have different colored clothes. Most people have no desire to leave. Well, that's just ridiculous. But you do more than anything and you might have found a way out by winning the mega jackpot millionaire lottery no just kidding uh help wanted looking for a young go-getter to accompany me to my old home bourbon bourbon voyage and accommodation will be your initial compensation anyone interested meet up and blah, blah, blah. you know what that went really fast so this old woman's gonna lead us to prosperity you leave for bourbon today Taking a Zeppelin? What is this, Germany? Well, this is safe. Especially as much smoke that's coming out of that. Where there's smoke, there's fire. Where there's fire, you don't want a combustible balloon around it. Believe me, history has shown that's not a good idea. We're now flying over Bourbon and we'll be landing shortly. Oh, look at this. Look at this. All passengers, please prepare to leave the airship. They're just going to throw us out. There's some dogs over there. Are they dingoes? Would they be dingoes down there? Is that what they call their dogs? Get out of my face. Fletch. Looks like we've landed. I'll tell you what. I'm glad I got the voice that we had on a uh, bomber crew. <laughs> you decided to cover me on this adventure, Steve. 
I was starting to think no one in South City was brave enough to join me. When you were the first and only person to respond to my ad, I knew you were the right person for the job. Well, you had limited choices. She's laughing about it. Oh dear, look at old Fletch Wap on. Let's get cracking, Steve. I'll see you outside, okay? Oh, look at this. Oh, we can jump. He's got... God, I got some kicks. Like... I think I'd like double jump there for a second. Oh, well, this is cool. I turned the render distance up really high. Oh, there's like a tower there. I see that. There's some birds. How do we, oh, it just automatically talked. Wow. Smell that fresh air? I'll tell you what, it feels good to finally be back on bourbon. <laughs> yeah, it does, let me tell you. Now, Steve, I'm going to need your help settled, okay? I'll give you this base tip. Take your time to find a good place for it. It'd be like our town hub. Take this map as well. If you have any questions, please just ask me. I haven't been back to bourbon in a very long time, but I think I could still be helpful. I'll be waiting by the dock to set up the base camp. If you get lost, check your map. I got a base tent and an island map. All right, let's check out the map of our island here. Oh, okay. Well, this is not proper. These rivers are ridiculous. Um, well, I guess over here is where we'll try to set up our main base. Maybe even down here. I don't know. Up here could be cool too. I, I don't. I don't know anything about this game. There's lots of rocks over here. Open pockets with tap. Okay. Um. Grab lock. Wow, this is cool. Yeah, I like kind of being over here, away from that. I do, I do want to know what that tower was. Uh, so how big is this thing? Sure, we'll put it right here. It's a tent. I'm going to say the tents are temporary. Well, this is where you decided to build, huh? It's absolutely perfect. Our new home here on Bourbon. Thank you so much for setting up the base tent. Oh, guess what? I actually have a tent for you, too. It's not much. But you can go on home. You know, there's plenty of room to spread out here on bourbon. Please take your time. <laughs> That's code for get away from me. Oh my god. That's actually pretty funny. Um, We got some trees here. We got some minerals. We got... Birds that run from me. What is this? Is this doggo? Can I pet him? Oh, he looks like such a good boy! His back legs, he's got some issues. Um. Alright, if she's gonna be there, I'll be over here. Oh, well, I get a little bitty tent. This isn't fair. Let's see what it looks like. Wow. Um, yeah, this is lackluster. Okay, somebody's getting screwed. I think it's me. Let me pick up some more wood over here. I don't even know. I just know in games like this, you need minerals. Or not minerals. There's another doggo. Can I have them all? I don't like their back legs. They need to fix their back legs. Anytime I've seen a dog. What are these? Yellow wattle flower. It's a yellow flower. Um... Right click kind of picks up everything. What is that? Is that a kangaroo with horns? Kangaroos don't have horns, do they? If kangaroos have horns, then I'm really scared of them because I've never, I don't think I've ever seen. Can I swim? I 
I'm sure I should be back talking to her, but I'm so mad about her giving me the little crappy tent. Like... That, uh, that hurt my feelings. I don't think she understands that. I also want to go to that tower that was over there. I need to remember it's like to the, uh, do I have a compass? That... So I'm guessing this is north. Yes, the red arrow at the top of the compass is north. So that tower was to the, uh, south. Alright, let's go in here and see what she says. You found a good place for your tent? I know it's not much, but I hope you like your new home. She's got like furniture and everything in here. I don't even have a place to sleep. I'll tell you what, you've got the spark, Steve. What is that? Some kind of disease? You see, most people back in South City are scared of leaving. There's something about the place that pulls the spark out of people. I'm gonna tell you what, we certainly aren't the first to leave. Have you ever heard of the Traveler, John? Uh, no I haven't. I'll tell you what, he's a bloody legend. Rumor is he traded a paperclip for a steamboat once. I don't believe that. Trading is in his very blood. John got in contact before we left South City. He's interesting in visiting with his shop here. I'll tell you what, we can't miss an opportunity like this. I reckon we get this visiting site deed ready for him. That way we'll have a place for any visitors who come to Bourbon. I'll let you decide the best place. Just be sure it's close by. I could put him on the other side of the island. Alright, we gotta place a site deed and then. Um, sure. Oh. A place where anyone can set up camp. Cool. Well, we've already got three places. This place is already finished. We're all set for visitors, huh? I bet you all are tired of that voice. Well done, Steve. We've only been here for a little while, but you've achieved so much already. Have you tried taking a break? Y'all remember when Earthbound, the dad would be like, don't play too much. Maybe you should take a break and take a nap or sleep or something. You remind me of my father. That's creepy. He was born right here on Bourbon, you know. There, there's no way, there's no houses and nothing. Did he, was he just, did the kangaroos with horns lay him out of their, their sack? He was a true blue adventurer through and through. He loved doing new things and came in track of all of his milestones in his journal. I wanted to meet those milestones myself, but I'm getting a bit long in the tooth. Alright, we're gonna get the journal. Yay. That journal means a lot to me. That's why I gave it away. I think my dad would be glad someone like you is looking after it. But I have a challenge for you. Uh oh. I want you to try to meet my father's milestones. Some of these are gonna take a long time, but there's no hurry. You're trapped in this game forever. I'm gonna add daily tasks just to give you more to do. Permit points. Oh God. So we have money. What are these dinks probably with a D? Uh, Cause it's dinkum. And then uh, permit money. You're gonna want a lot of permit points. We'll talk about that tomorrow. Oh my God. What kind of face is that? That is creepy. Are you hungry? I am. I think it's about lunchtime. Go get fruit. <sighs> so I gotta go get food. Oh my god. Okay, we got 100 permanent points for setting up a camp. That's cool, I guess. Uh, how do I get off this screen? Then we got that for doing this. What do we got? Harvest three bush lime, catch two bugs, craft one item. Cool. What else do we have here? Get her something to eat. People, we've only met her. We don't know anything about her. That's creepy. We just met this old lady and we just went some remote place with her. We don't know what any anim animals are. Cool. All right, let's go find her some fruit. Oh. I didn't even notice that. Like, right there. Is that another? Can I zoom? Like, it is a kangaroo with, like, horns. Now I'm, like, really confused if that's a real thing or not. And the doggos. I don't know about the doggos yet. 
I know I was only supposed to get three of these, but I'm gonna get some more because I'm sure that I'll be able to eat them too. And that just makes sense. I played a game or two in my day. There's dogs everywhere. I want all the puppies. Can I have like a dog army that like protects the base? That would be like the greatest thing in the world. All right, let's take your food. Here's your food. Oh, you found something to eat? It will keep your energy up. Here's the recipe for the camp. Like, is it really called a recipe to make a campfire? I found these stones earlier. You can use to craft your campfire. You have to find some wood, though. Come and chat with me. She's got a gift for me. What'd she give me? Oh, rocks. And the campfire blueprint. Cool. Um, I'll put the campfire out here in the middle in the grass so that it, uh, it causes issues. How do I build things? Okay, I did that. It automatically counts on that. Um, man, I'm on the build camera. Thing is not quick move. Split stack. We can look at options. Does that it tell me? Pick speed fast. Um, let's see. I was kind of hoping there'd be a zoom button too, but it doesn't. Vehicles. Oh, you can just swap camera mode. That's unfortunate. But after walking around like an idiot, you have to go to the crafting table and then make the campfire here. Because, you know, that's what you do. You you make a campfire and then you carry it to where you want it. In case some of you all didn't know that, um, that's how that works. So, we have rock paths, we have torches. That's cool. We'll burn out by the end of the day. Well, that's sad. I'm not like Minecraft. Alright, so we got our campfire. Let's put it here in the grass so it will catch fire. We can also pick it up somehow. And I like our little setup here. This is nice. This is, I, I like it. All right, Fletch, what do you got for me now? I'm very impressed with your work you've done here, Steve. There's a great future for us here, Bourbon. No wonder we had to bring books and everything for, good Lord. A bug net. You should take the rest of the day off. Nah, you just, maybe you could go catch some bugs. Maybe you could go catch some of the bugs around here. Or maybe you could cook stuff for the fruit you found. I'll find something to do. I'm sure you will. Ha ha ha. Take this sleeping bag. Oh, she finally gave me a place to sleep. When you get tired, pop that on the ground and have a lay down. A good night's rest will do us both good. Ha ha ha. I can't believe we're on bourbon. It's kind of cute. She's so happy about it. Uh, this bug net, we're going to totally be like, go on a butterfly and bug genocide. I know butterflies are a big thing. I saw them earlier. Uh, can I make anything else? Fences. Fires. Um, I can make my own crafting table. Tin bar nails. Yeah, we don't have any of that. I don't like that I can't like hit right click to get out of this menu. A cooking table. Uh, we need planks and stuff again. So we're going to have to have some kind of thing to make planks. I don't know how to do that. Oh, I could have just hit all. I'm done. All right. Uh, yeah. Bugs. Catch the dog. Come here. What about the bird? Wait, there's a bug. Ha ha! A Tau Emerald Dragonfly. I am the master. Uh, let's put my sleeping bag down here. I have some place to go to. Alright, let's go on our adventure to get bugs. Uh, can I pick up? Ooh, you pick up these shells and stuff too. I wanna, is that a bug? Hits the bird. Come here. Come here! He's so slow. He is so slow with this bug. I know it's supposed to be me. Um, oh, these are sand dollars. Man, I used to collect sand dollars all the time. Uh, I just did an achievement. What was it? Hell yeah! Oh, we're getting permit points like crazy. 
Oh, hello. A Scarlet Jezebel butterfly. Wow, that is uh, interesting. What is this in the water? Oh, I thought it was a duck. I was totally going to try to get it. Blue moon butterfly. Tons of butterflies. Told you all. We're going to catch every butterfly on this island. This is a cool little place over here, too. I need to go to the tower. That's what we'll do to end the episode. Because I know we're... I don't want it to be too long. I want to keep these kind of relatively short. Uh, these do stack. Cool. I was a little worried they wouldn't. I'm sure... Oh, I wonder if this is like... I remember one of my friends talking about like on Animal Crossing. Um, what is that? A funnel web spider. That sounds like something that would kill me. Uh, what was it? Tom Nook? Is that the dude from that game? And he like... Uh, he like makes you pay money or something. You're in debt. Hopefully that's not a thing. Um, but we'll see. I'm already just enjoying the way this game looks. All right, let's, uh, I don't, okay, everything's stacking, so that's good. I always worry and panic in games like this that um, stuff doesn't stack and then you just fill up your inventory and I feel like that would mean I'll have to throw stuff down and it's a waste. But uh, it seems like we're good. Okay, let's go to this tower. That won't pick up everything. Oh, but I see two butterflies. We've got to get these. <laughs> A Ulysses butterfly. Obviously, Ninja Turtle President. And that one's pretty. Oh, that's another Scarlet Jezebel. Okay. Let's go over here. If we see anything, we'll capture it. I mean, liberate it in the honor of Bourbon Island here. Oh. This thing looks broken. There are parts missing. Should I place something inside? Uh, no. Because I'm not an electrician. Uh, but that's cool. So, yeah. I thought I'd be able to climb it. I'm kind of a little upset about that. But it's probably just some kind of radio thing. There are so many dogs around here. All right, let's head back. And uh, I think we'll... Is that a turkey? What is it? Oh, that's another one of the things. The doggos are swimming! Oh my god, that's so cool! This looks like a turkey, isn't it? Can I net him? I just want dinner. Ah, uh, we can't net him. This net is really letting me down. It's like, and I know because the other day I walked outside and literally the animal patrol people of my city were, had a big old net like this and they were chasing down a black chicken that was going down the road and they caught him in between the house next to mine. So I know it can be done. The game is just not letting me do it. But for now. I'm going to hold my dragonfly, and we're going to call it an episode, so I hope you all enjoyed this. Uh, I'm going to try to keep these a little short, but uh, let me know in the comments what you're thinking, what you want to see. If you've played this game, just let me know what to look for. Uh, don't give me any spoilers or anything, but just let me know uh, anything I need to think about, uh, if you're an Animal Crossing uh, person or things like that. But uh, I'm very excited to play this and get some new content on the page. But as always, thank you all so much for watching. God bless. Don't forget to make good decisions. I'll see you next time. Check out some more of my content here. I hope you enjoy that as well. And I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.